Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. I hope you all are fine and staying safe and happy. I am your GK teacher, Ms. Farheen, and I welcome you all to your GK class. My dear students, as you know, that we have started unit number 13, that is energy and its resources, and today I will deliver its first lecture. So, my dear students, uh, let's quickly move forward towards uh, the lecture with an activity. So, here you can see a few pictures. A boy is eating some fruits and you can see that someone is pouring oil or fuel inside a motorbike. Now, do you think, uh, uh, know what is energy? Do you know what energy is? Do you think that if I drink water, my energy will be more. या अगर मैं खाना खाऊंगा तो एकदम से एनर्जी आ जाती है आपके अंदर या रोजा रखने के बाद आपकी एनर्जी कम हुई भी होती है और जब आप जैसे ही खाना खाते हैं तो आप एकदम से आपके अंदर एनर्जी आ जाती है सो दैट मींस फूड जो है वो हमें एनर्जी प्रोवाइड करता है और एनर्जी क्या होती है एनीथिंग व्हिच हेल्प्स यू टू परफॉर्म डिफरेंट वर्क्स और परफॉर्म डिफरेंट फंक्शंस दैट इज कॉल्ड एनर्जी सो इफ यू डू नॉट ईट फूड व्हाट विल हैपन टू यू वी विल डाई एनर्जी कम हो जाएगी हमारे जो डिफरेंट ऑर्गन्स हैं वो काम नहीं कर सकेंगे हमारी बॉडी प्रॉपरली फंक्शन नहीं कर सकेगी उसको वो एनर्जी नहीं मिलेगी जिससे काम करना होता है सो दैट मींस हमें फूड चाहिए एनर्जी के लिए सो कैन अ बाइक मूव विदाउट फ्यूल इसी तरह क्या आपकी गाड़ी या आपकी मोटर बाइक जो है वो तेल के बगैर या फ्यूल जो उसके अंदर पेट्रोल या डीजल डलता है उसके बगैर चल सकती है नहीं चल सकती वाई बिकॉज दिस फ्यूल पेट्रोल और डीजल provides energy to the car or the bike for movement. So my dear students, now this is our student learning outcome. In today's lecture, students will be able to recognize that energy is required for doing work. So مختلف طرح کے کام کرنے کے لیے ہمیں energy چاہیے ہوتی ہے. آج ہم یہ recognize کر سکیں گے. So in today's lesson, we will discuss all about energy. So Islamic perspective, he hath constrained the night and the day and the sun and the moon to be to be of service unto you so my dear students different cheeze hain suraj jo hai iski bhi hum energy ko use kar sakte hain aur din aur raat jo hai ye allah taala ne hamare hi behtari ke liye banaye hain aur in mein jo suraj hai ye to tamam energy jo sources hain usme top of the list jo hai wo sun aata hai और सन जो है ये लाइफ एग्जिस्टेंस के लिए भी इस दुनिया में बहुत ही ज्यादा इंपॉर्टेंट है सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स सम प्री रीडिंग क्वेश्चंस क्विकली टेल मी फ्रॉम वेयर वी गेन एनर्जी फूड वेरी गुड हाउ वी डू आर वर्क डेली विद द हेल्प ऑफ एनर्जी व्हाट टाइप ऑफ एनर्जी इज अराउंड अस सोलर एनर्जी लाइट एनर्जी विंड एनर्जी so these are some energies which we can see around us. इसके अलावा different gases हैं जो कि आपके fuels हैं जो हमारी गाड़ियों में और हमारे घर में जलते हैं और energy provide करते हैं. So is everything is does everything work with energy? Yes, everything needs energy to perform different functions and for working they need energy. So my dear students, now let's move forward towards the reading. I request you all to please open page hundred, page number one hundred and twenty in your GK three books. Very good. So my dear students, let's first quickly look at the pictures. Here you can see picture number A, a boy with a goat. So a boy and a goat both are living things. So how do they perform their different functions, or what do they need for movement? They need energy. And where do they get the energy? From food. Very good. Here in picture B, you can see a man is putting fuel inside a bike. So for movement, this bike needs fuel. And this fuel provides energy to the bike. For playing, this boy needs energy. And where does he get the energy? From the food. Now, here you can see a fan. So this fan also needs energy or power for working, for moving. So where does this energy come from? Kya jab light hoti hai? Light ke bagayari pankha chal sakta hai? No. So electricity provides energy this, to this fan for movement and for working. Now let's start the reading. Energy is the ability to do work. 
Now observe the following pictures as we have, as we have already done. In the above pictures, food energy make animals and humans move. In a bike, fuel energy, petrol, makes it run. A ball moves due to the energy of the child he is applying on the bat. The fan moves due to electrical energy. So my dear students, everything moves with the energy. So energy is the ability to do work. Koi bhi kaam karne ke liye living things ko ya non-living things ko energy chahiye. So without energy, none of the above things or organisms can move. Just imagine a goat not finding its food for many days. What will happen? The goat will die because it will not have energy to move its body parts. So, it is actually energy or power that makes things move. So, my dear students, students, agar living things ko khana nahi milega, so unki body may different functions perform karne ke liye energy nahi hogi and ultimately if they will not eat for many days, they will die. So, food provides energy to living things. Whereas different non-living things like fan, uh, AC, car, motorbike, they need external energy for movement. So everything around us needs energy for movement and performing different functions. So my dear students, energy is the ability to do work. Everything needs energy. Whether it's living things or non-living things, they need energy. Here in this picture, you can see this man. For pushing this cart, this man needs energy and for moving this cart also needs energy. So this is living and this is non-living both need energy for working and moving. So in one picture you can see the example of both living and non-living things. Next here you can see three living things boy, girl and a goat all need energy for movement and perform different for, and for performing different functions. So, human beings and living things get their energy from their food. Uh, for playing, for running, for reading, for writing, for moving, for walking, they need energy with the, which they get from the food. So, we get energy from our food. Energy we gain from food helps to do our work and to make us move. So, fuel energy. So, this car needs fuel or isko movement ke liye energy chahiye jo ke isko fuel se milti hai. And this fan, it also needs energy. And this moves with the help of electrical energy. Isko bijli ke zarurat hai movement ke liye. And electri electricity is also a form of energy. So, solar energy is also a form of energy. Ye so, uh, he, uh, sun ki energy hoti hai. Jo ke mukhtalif electricity generate karne mein ya aur kaam karne mein helpful hai. Then there is thermal energy, yani ke heat energy. Now is the time for practice. You can download this worksheet from the description box below this video or you can get it in print form by your teacher. So my dear students, write down your name and your class then match each object with the correct option. So here are some forms of energy given. Heat, electricity and fuel. Which uh, energy is helpful hai? you have to match the form of energy with the picture. Okay, let me do the first for you. So for lighting the bulb, electricity is required as energy. You will complete the rest of the worksheet. Now we will move forward towards the question answers given in the worksheet. Answer the questions. What is energy? So you have to define the energy. Uh, energy is the uh, uh, when we do work that is energy is required for doing work. What are the different sources of energy we use? We have different sources of energy food, electricity, solar energy, thermal energy, heat energy, fuel, these all are different energies that we use in our daily life. So now is the time for evaluation. For that, we will move forward towards page 100, number 126. These are listening and speaking questions. Listen to them very carefully and then orally answer them. So question number one, what is energy? The power for performing different functions and work that is called energy. What does a bike, uh, how does a bike move? With the help of fuel energy. Which thing makes a fan running? Electrical energy, very good. What is the energy source of a goat and a boy? Food, very good. So my dear students, now quickly note down your homework. For homework, 
you will do home activity number one and you will also do question number one uh, given on page number 128 define energy you will do this question in your notebooks so my dear students now is the time for wrap up so energy is the ability to do work everything needs energy a boy can move due to food energy a bike can move uh, due to fuel energy and a fan can run due to electrical energy so everything living and non-living they need energy to do different works so the ability to do work is called energy so my dear students i hope you have understood about energy so keep everybody around you safe have a good day thank you so much and allah Hafiz.